Hi, I hope everybody's uh, keeping well and keeping your hands washed and keeping sane at the moment in this crazy world that we have. So this is the talk about Marianne Mercer Carnsey. Um, we, she's one of the people who's going to be in our large uh, picture, but there's only a certain amount of people that kind of came into our sphere. So um, we reached out to uh, Helia, who lives in Iran, and said, which, which, which woman um, in particular uh, would uh, inspire you? You know, so Helia's a, a young Iranian girl. She's an artist, of it, so she's a great, great, great girl. Anyway, so she came back with two. Uh, there's a cosmonaut lady, who's the first uh, Iranian lady in space. And... Uh, also uh, Maria Mezcanzi and we read both of them and we thought that you know Marion was just really great she has a beautiful mind and uh, I, I'm really interested in space and things like that and uh, you, you can't visualize space and you the only way you can understand space is, is numbers and uh, people like Marianne they they create the the forms in the mind from from using numbers and maths, because we can't comprehend these distances and things and how things work. And, and it's just, and she, she, and she, she, and she worked on the, yeah, the maths of surfaces. How obscure is that? It's really, really odd. Anyway, she uh, unfortunately she died of breast cancer um, at the age of 40. She actually ended up studying at Stanford in America, Stanford University. So um, yeah, so she's in our picture and I hope you're all all right, remember, keep washing your hands, everybody. Let's let's just go over and see what Michelle's up to over by the window. Come over there, Michelle. Okay, okay. <laughs> Michelle, she's she's had a very busy week at work. She works in the lab at the hospital, and uh, I reckon that the next few months are going to be pretty pretty full on for her. It's the calm before the storm at the moment, and uh, we we're going, getting up very very early in the morning to try and get her some food from Tesco's. Uh, but um, they've, they've got an NHS shopping hour now, haven't they? Yeah. Yeah, well, sun, Sunday, Sunday mornings at 10 o'clock, so NHS staff can shop, which is really, really good. And um, yeah, so it's, and we've been out socialising in the woods, which is nice. So many people out, it's just amazing. And the sun's come out as well. But it will keep our spirits up and keep busy, haven't we? Yeah, we'll keep busy. I'm sure it's going to be 